Is your SD card asking to be formatted or not showing your files? That's often a sign of corruption, but the good news is your data can still be saved. In this video, we'll first show you how to recover your files, and then how to fix the card without formatting, although sometimes, to be honest, formatting can't be avoided. Before trying to fix your SD card, make sure to recover your data first. Otherwise, it could be permanently deleted or overwritten, and since SD cards are quite sensitive storage devices, the risk of corruption doubles. That's why it's safer to start with a byte-to-byte -byte backup of your card and then work on that copy, not the original. For this reason, once again, we're choosing Disk Drill, a reliable tool that combines both data recovery and byte-to-byte -byte backup features. First, download and install Disk Drill on your computer. We'll leave a link to the official website in the video description. Insert your corrupted SD card into the computer using a card reader. If Windows prompts you to format the card when you connect it, just click Cancel. Open Disk Drill, go to the sidebar and choose Byte to Byte Backup. Select your SD card from the list, then click the Byte to Byte Backup button at the top. Choose a safe location on your computer with enough free space, the backup will be the same size as your SD card. Click OK and wait for the process to finish. Once the backup is ready, go to Storage Devices in Disk Drill and click Attach Disk Image. Select the backup you just created, and start a scan by clicking Search for Lost Data. At this stage, you'll need to pick a scan type, Universal Scan or Advanced Camera Recovery. Start with Universal, and if your recovered videos turn out corrupted, try Advanced Camera Recovery, it's built for fragmented video files from SD cards. When the scan is running, you can already see recoverable files appear. Use filters to sort by file type, and preview to confirm the files are intact. Mark the files you want and click Recover. Pick a safe destination on another drive, never recover back to the same SD card. After this, your data will be safe, and you can move on to fixing the SD card without formatting. Now let's move on to the actual fixes. And if you're lucky, the issue might not be with the SD card at all, but simply with the reader or USB port. So, try another USB port on your computer. If that doesn't help, try testing the reader on a different computer, and finally, consider using a different card reader altogether. If the problem isn't with the port or the card reader, the next step is to run a check disk scan. CHKDSK is a built-in Windows tool that looks for file system errors and fixes them. With the slash R parameter, it also checks for bad sectors. Running CHKDSK can sometimes cause data loss, so recover your files or make a byte-to-byte -byte backup first. To run it, right-click the Start button and choose Terminal, Admin. Then type, CHKDSKD, slash R slash X, replace D, with your SD card's letter, and press Enter. Windows will scan the card and fix errors automatically. When it's done, check the summary and try opening your SD card in File Explorer. If check disk didn't solve the issue, the next fix is to add or change the drive letter. Sometimes Windows either doesn't assign a letter at all, or there's a conflict with another device, and that makes your SD card inaccessible. To fix this, right-click Start and select Disk Management. Find your SD card, right-click it, and choose Change Drive Letter and Paths. If no letter is assigned, click Add. If there is one, click Change. Pick a new letter from the list, and confirm with OK. If none of the earlier fixes worked, the issue may be with the partition itself. When the partition table of your SD card gets corrupted, Windows can't recognize it and asks you to format. In this case, you can try Test Disk, a free tool that repairs damaged partitions. Download and extract Test Disk, then open the file TestDisk underscore win. When prompted, press Enter to create a new log file, this is just for recording the process. From the list of devices, highlight your SD card and press Enter. Test Disk will ask you to pick the partition table type. Usually, the default one is correct, just press Enter. Press Enter again to start analyzing the partition structure. Run a quick search to look for lost partitions. If your missing partition shows up, highlight it and press Enter. Select Write and press Enter to save the repaired partition table. Confirm with Y restart your computer and check if your SD card is accessible again. If you've tried everything above and the SD card still won't work, the non-format fixes are exhausted, you'll need to format the card. Don't panic, if you made a byte-for-byte -byte backup at the start, as we showed, your data is safe and can be restored afterward. We'll leave a link in the video description to a step-by-step -step guide on how to properly format an SD card, follow that if you need to proceed. Thanks for watching, and good luck!
If you still have questions, write them in the comments under this video, we'll be happy to help.